Hey everybody, this is just going to be a quick tutorial on how to turn your iPod into an external hard drive. Um, basically what that means is whenever you plug it in, you'll see it under my computer. So here's my iPod, and if I open it, you see now this is all the stuff that Apple puts on. So it holds your calendars, contacts, and notes, which can, which can be accessed from inside your iPod. Now I have this folder called Storage, and inside I have all my folders, just like I would put on a flash drive. And that can be pulled out and same thing same way you do with an external hard drive or a flash drive so let's get started first what we're going to want to do is obviously plug in your iPod and open iTunes okay so now you have iTunes open and you're going to go to your your iPod inside iTunes okay now at the bottom, when, you, when you're on the main page of your iPod, if you scroll down, you'll see manually manage music and videos, and then enable disk use. That's what we're looking for, enable disk use. So what you want to do here is, if this is grayed out, see how it's grayed out for me? If I uncheck this, this will be able to be checked or unchecked. And then you can recheck manually manage music or videos. Sounds confusing, but if you if this isn't checked, this will be available. So all you want to do is check enable disk use. And if you check manually manage music and videos, it should be enabled anyway. Now, once you do that, you should just open up my computer and you should see your iPod right there. And you could do the same thing with anything that you plug in, such as a flash drive or an external. Like I said before, you can make a new folder. Um, so here, I'll make a new folder and I'll just call it test. I'll just copy this shortcut. So you interact with it the same way you would any external flash drive, and it's on your iPod. And it, your music will still work too, which is a great feature. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Um, please leave suggestions, comments, rate the video, and be sure to subscribe and check out our Facebook page.